Let's have a oh, look. you can see the statues on the side here. Those are the full statues of Shard. Oh. So I, I'm guess, man, uh, I bet you anything that uh, Shadowheart is having a ball. She should be. Yeah. She sure is being quiet. No, I know. She hasn't asked to talk about anything. These skeletons are not, they don't have anything in them. There's yeah, they are pretty empty. This These place. Boots have seen everything. They have seen everything, yes. These vases don't have anything in them. Uh, am I still sneaking? No. Uh, if everyone else minds their business, I'll be fine. Free for the taking. <laughs> Free for the taking. <laughs> this place is massive, but there's it's like it's like there's nothing here. There is a uh, way to get down. Oh, this is overlooking. We're way, we are up above where we were before. Right? We are. Mm. Is there anything on the map? Okay. Um. Ooh, I'm sending you a scroll of invisibility I just picked up. Where did you get that? It was just sitting on the ledge here. Oh. Uh, there's an orb of dark vision. Perception failed. Okay. So. All right. Well, there are some, some traps. Pure shadow. Around me. Inside me. Uh oh I received the con condition dark vision. Why would that n negatively impact me? Well, I don't think it did. I have dark vision but, already, don't I? Uh, I I think so as a gnome. That's a bit weird. Where are you going? Oh really? You think you're going to do this. that, are you? We got pretty high strength, but no, I can't make it. There's blood over here. Something bad happened here. <laughs> you can get over there from across the way, so I think we can get over there eventually. We just have to go uh, this way. How much way. farther can I go? How much? Oh. Be cautious. Uh, what? <laughs> Gargoyle. No trap. Oh, it's a it's a trap. Yeah, I'm going to try to disarm it. Okay. My bonus is 12 to 15. On the, I got to roll. So if I roll a 2, I'm fine. Okay. okay. <laughs> well, you... I got 24. All right. It lost its head. You know, I'm kind of injured again. Was that because of the blow... The, that, that where we got blowed up a bit? Uh, yeah, it was. Sorry about that. Okay. I, I took a potion. I'm back to almost not quite. Oh, God. There's a trap. Okay, backing off. <laughs> uh... I don't know if, I, if disarming this will turn it off. I'm going to try, though. Yeah, we're good. Not really. <laughs> so it doesn't turn it off. Someone's There's left another one. Out for us. Oh, I'm gonna. I'm sorry, I'm exiting turn based mode. It does that to make sure you don't get like utterly destroyed when you when you do a, a trap. Oh, you trigger a trap. There we go. Oh, wait a minute. It was off for a second there. You turned it off next to it? There's a way to turn it off? Uh, I don't know why it turned off. 
Oh, it's times. Oh. Okay. All right, well, I'm going to not sneak anymore because that makes me slow. Oh. Or you could do that. Yeah, I was trying to disarm it, but... Traps. Power oh, issues shoot. with the... Um, I should have went into, into turn-based mode to disarm it. Be careful. There are traps about. Yeah, I went into turn-based mode real quick, okay. so I can try to disarm this. Okay, okay. That marble plate is a trap. Yep. I got that side. I'm going to end turn-based mode because I can't, uh... I can't do a second trap because it's an action. Alright. Turn-based mode. Now I can disarm again. Okay. I'm going to exit turn base mode, <laughs> and I'm going to have him disarm this middle plate. Roll the dirty 20. <laughs> <laughs> uh, do you want to continue on Do I, I, while I go down? Uh... Yeah, feel free to go down that area. And, There's and a long and sword ahead. mold down there. We will want those molds. There is levers. There's levers over here. I had a heavy play, chest. Play the levers. Good here, right? They do. Just don't blow yourself up. Okay. Throw in the one on the left. Okay, it goes up. And if I do the one on the right, it shifts over. Oh, it's a way to cross over. <clears throat> cross over to the other side. Flip it back. It comes all the way back, presumably. And down. So I need to go into turn-based mode real quick. Okay. At least it's armed. Okay. Okay, good in. It's turn-based mode. All right, I'm going to quick save. Okay. <laughs> going to jump uh, back into turn-based mode here in a second. Okay. Because there's a lot of things to disarm. <laughs> Ah. Need a 15, roll a 30. All right. So I got most of these things disarmed. I'm not sure how to proceed, though. I'm getting the longsword mode. Cool. Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll definitely want to grab those modes. I am encumbered. Uh, I'm going to give that to Czar. Because, you know. Oh! Yeah, that works. There's a little tiny skeleton here. I assume it's a gnome skeleton. Probably is. Can't slow down. Wow. Uh, I'm way over here. By the way, we can get across the to the other side if we use this uh, thing. But I don't know. Okay. Can I only send one person over? Oh, I know. I know what we can do. Is there, an, is there another movement? Oh, it's too high. I can't get out of here. I'm trapped. Well, here, let me... I'm going to do turn-based mode again. Because I've got... Oh, you know what? This is going to be rough.
Okay, I have an idea. <clears throat> okay, so I'm getting out of turn based mode. So if you want to play around, go for it. Next, I wonder. <clears throat> oh, unfortunately, uh, Angela can't get over here. Have a long uh, uh, mind. Water jump. And well, in it. Oh, she can. <clears throat> Perfect. Have to keep going. All right, I'm over. <laughs> I don't know where you are, but I'm on the other side. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying. I'm trying to disarm the the traps here. And it's unfortunately, it's really not making it easy. It's very involved, is it? Yeah. I'm gonna have to hit turn-based mode once I can figure out what's on, like what's on fire. All right, I'm gonna try it now. I don't know how it's gonna work, but. Oh, okay. I found you. Oh. <laughs> but every time I. I keep, uh, oh, I can see on the other side. Okay, so this is locked. This place is so big. I need him to run out of the way so, so he's get flamed. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna turn off turn base mode. I don't think I can get back there because it's just spewing flames. Uh, or did it stop spewing flames? I don't see flames. I'll disarm this other one then. Yeah, it's. It's it's on fire, but it's definitely not um, shooting those flames out. So that's good. Maybe I can get in here. Things locked. Okay, I'm not sure how to get through there. I'll come join you. Come on down. The water's warm. It's beautiful <laughs> over here. Uh, I can send the. Um, Shouldn't have wished to live in more interesting times. You know what I could do? I could do this. Um, jump up over here. And then get over there. Come on over. Okay. And then what I do is I just take this and I basically shoot that. Come on over! <laughs> Can you uh, get past me? There we go. Yeah. Okay. There we go. Still All right. You can jump. All right. You ready? Ready for uh, the trip? Yeah. Let's go. <laughs> and then we come over here. We're over. Ha ha ha. Now, there is, like, skeletons all over the place. They don't really seem to have anything of, of any use. Is it just me, or do these look like, like uh, human skeletons? They seem, yeah, they seem like humans. I'm just checking out what's up top here. It's the other side of that uh, little bridge that we couldn't jump across. Yeah, yeah. 
Oh, look, if we step over here, we can look out over the where the, we fought the oozes. Oh. Wow. You know, this place is amazing. Like the design, the level design. It's really cool. Yeah, it, it, there's it's. They put a lot of time and effort into this and it shows. There's blood out here. And broken shackles. There's tracks there. Or footprints. That's worth a look. There's a bloody footprint on the floor, like right next to you in a way. Like near the chain or the broken shackles. Uh I don't see it. Oh. Yeah. What happened here? It's hard to make any sense of this mess. I, I, I didn't. My survival failed. What happened here? It's hard to make any Something sense of this happened mess. Here. But what? <laughs> uh, <I guess> it... <sighs> what a mess. <laughs> <sighs> what a mess. <sighs> what a mess. So it doesn't let us. Uh... Each of us happened here? roll for survival. It's Only hard to make any sense of this mess. In. Well, something happened That's here. Odd. There's a bit of a mess. Yeah. Don't waste a step. But we don't know what. All right. So that's a shame. I kind of wish we were to figure that out because on my previous playthrough, I was I missed those rolls too. That is weird. Yeah, it usually would let us have each of our team members roll when they when they try, but I don't know if that maybe that they change that mechanic a bit in one of their patches. I don't know. Oh, there's arrows. Here. It's hard to make any sense of this mess. <laughs> All right. Well, I have no idea, and I don't think. Uh, yeah, let's get out of here. Where did you get to? I went, just went back to okay. where the little All right. thing pulled us over to. We have to go through a door, apparently. There's a wooden truck What's here. Oh, there's a plaque. It's a dorm. Warhammer and a scimitar. Uh... Come, all who are weary. Sleep and forget. Okay. Light that bad boy up. There we go. All right, so... Do a quick save uh... just in case. I didn't... Okay, I went through the door. Maybe I accidentally... Here, quick save. Okay, and... All right, so there's a lot of stuff in here. This feels like a trap. Does it feel like a trap? It's definitely... Uh... It feels like a tomb. It, it feels like a lair. Ooh, I'm sending you a scroll of greater invisibility. Oh, is that where I can actually do something while I'm invisible? You can, but they have done... I'm, I'm sending you a scroll of hypnotic pattern. Um, but they've made... They've made a change to it, um, which I really don't like. Greater invisibility in D&D &D usually lets you, um, you know, go invisible. You can attack or something like that. You'll be br you'll briefly invisible until your next turn, or briefly visible until your next turn um, at, like, disadvantage to hit or something. And then you go invisible again. Well, it has a duration of, like, however many turns. In, in Baldur's Gate 3, you have to keep making checks every single round to see if you can keep your greater invisibility up. So they just threw the rules out the window. And it's a very, in my opinion, it's rather useless because those checks get harder every single time you have to try it. Which is very, I was very disappointed when I found that out. Ah, I have a letter. 
Ooh. Master Kethrick, my whip has finally coaxed some particulars from the captive Harper. To wit, she revealed the lo- to the, she revealed the location of her stockpile on a rocky overlook. I investigated, but found the chest in question is trapped. Any attempt to open it might break its contents completely. The spy refused to reveal how to open the chest. Under some, uh, even under threat of death, only crying "Lux Splenda" with every lash. Uh, some type of watchword, no doubt. The interrogation continues, and again, please accept my most humble apologies for my earlier oversight. Rest assured, I will not misidentify any more of my fellow Sharons as spies. May they walk forever in shadow. Just a car, Sybil. So, <laughs> Lux Splenda. So, Lux is light, right? What's that watchword? Yep. Lux Splenda. Okay. What does it mean? We don't know. We we uh we didn't uh, we didn't make our check. So yeah, we we failed our our check. But if you look at your map, you look a little bit west of the Underdark Grimforge um, Harper Stash thing there. Yeah, which is that area you wanted to get into. Yeah. Well, I think it's time we went upstairs. Probably gonna get in yeah. Trouble. Just check. I just check in the skeleton just in case they have something on them. There's only bones yeah, so far. Yeah, I, che I checked them. This one has Frostdale. Uh, These are Sharon weapons. I would recognize the Night Singer's blades anywhere. Uh huh. Oh, there's another All book. Right. The Canticles of the let's Dark see. Mistress. Uh, let shadow fall where light doth creep and silence cloak the din. Let blackness into lost hearts seep and bid our lady in. Behold, Shar who shades our path. Behold, Shar whom uh, from. Ao born, behold Shar the primal dark, our goddess of night. Behold. Well, all right then. Apparently, they they like Shar. Yeah, I wasn't sure what you. Oh, I found a shield mold. That's good. That's cool. It was on a skeleton. And there's a bottle. Just a regular old bottle. So when you looked at them, like I, I I for some reason thought you said like. Kinkles of our late of our mistress or something like that. Like, that's <laughs> terrible. That's gonna get you in trouble. Canting. <laughs> There's a bed here. I did. Take rest. Nap time. Super comfy. Yeah, these are not comfortable beds. Well, I guess we're gathering outside this door. Uh, thinking that maybe we might want to do something with it. Infernal Legion. Did you see that? I did. There's uh, hoofs in, uh, on the other side. You know what? Um, Let's get going. I'm bringing up here. Uh, you. No one back home will ever step believe back. This. You. Hmm. Step back here. No. No. Stop it. Angela, time to rest. get back. Let's be on my way. Okay. Uh, they are no longer Infernal Legion. Lost condition. Infernal Legion. That was our condition. What is that? You are you are <laughs> one. You are Legion without personality or individuality, born only to fight. When within 20 meters of another creature wearing Maragon's mask, strength increases by one and intelligence, wisdom... And uh, charisma decreased by one per near my nearby mask. Well, that's cool. You can take that mask off if you want. I'm <laughs> thinking I might want to. Would you like to wear it? Sure, why not? Okay. I am sending that to Czar because he doesn't need intelligence or wisdom in his line of work. Right? No, he just likes to the slice and dice. Okay, you got you, you gonna put your mask on? It is on. It's good. Oh no it isn't. Alright. Uh oh I'm, I here. Here you go. Um there you go. Oh hi Okay, uh, I'm gonna F five. There's something uh hooved behind this door. Are these Roth? 
Um, since there's a Merrigan mask nearby, I'm gonna think they're probably a little more infernal than Roth. Oh, they've got they've got hooves because they're they're kind of that kind of hoofdy type things. I think so. I'm gonna get Asterion in a position where he could stay, hopefully hidden, and deal some nice damage with his bow. You know, no time to dally. Shadowheart could probably do something about protection from, uh, like, turning undead. No, they're not undead though, are they? Are they evil? No, I think, I think they're demons. Yeah, evil, right? Yeah. Yeah, she doesn't. Uh... Oh, revivify, beacon of hope. Oh, beacon of hope. This is takes concentration. Uh, you will gain maximum hit points pos uh, possible when healed. They also gain advantage when wisdom saving throws. Okay, that that's not useful. Aid. Preserve life, cure wounds, guiding bolt. Okay. Oh, spirit guardians. Yeah, we're doing that. Turn undead. No, no, less. Uh, resistance, healing word. Hold person, sacred flame. I bet you sacred flame does a, a real nice number on them. Yes, I think they, I mean, as long as they're, what, um, weak to radiant. We'll find out once we open this door. <laughs> <laughs> now let me know when you're ready and I'll open the door and. Okay. Um... All's well that ends. Not as bad as it could have. Okay, open the door. Actually, I'm going to hide. Oh. Oh, there are Roth. No, these are Hellsbor. And a Maragon Legionnaire. Is he wearing his little mask? He is wearing his little mask. <laughs> Very cool. I'm going to go ahead and... Oh, I am not first by any means. Um, it's Angela. But let me take a look at something because I think... I can get a really nice shot off from a staring. I could do a fireball. Begin the battle. Fireball? Um, yeah. Yeah, go for it. I can get these three in the back. Yeah, go for it. These two in the back. <laughs> oh, I didn't realize he was in the back. I thought he was considered to be in the front. <laughs> Wild magic! Until the end of your next turn, you can use a bonus action. Ooh. Uh, I don't know what I'm going to do with that, but that's fine. Um, these Hellsbor are not in great shape, by the way. Okay, no, well... That's pretty good. I mean, I think we're as good as we can get right now. Okay. Uh, oh, uh, oh, rush on me. Tides of chaos. Wait a minute. How is what? he going to get can't... to me from between? But what? He must be trying to charge through me. I'm I, OK. I guess I will. Should I not react? Maybe not react. I don't yeah, know. Um, if you if you uh, mouse over rush it should tell you what it does. So this is charge forward, attack all enemies and objects in the way. Okay, so essentially it's going to go right through you. That's what it seems like. So uh, you tied both up here. There we go. Okay. And you saved. Okay. Yeah. Wow, that thing is uh, something else. He's a little squishy, right. though. That was nice. They weren't. I think they weren't happy with me because of my uh, because I fireballed them. What do you think? That's quite possible. You're on fire. Boy, I missed. 
Yeah, I'm, I'm just that. Uh, their their blood is fiery. That, that, is that hot right now? I guess. Okay. <laughs> Not much I can do other. Oh, than another one's coming. Wow. Are you oh, gonna do? I can an, opportunity at, attack. Yeah, I see that. I didn't. I didn't catch that until right then. Okay, he's dead. Shadow heart. Hellspore's got one hit point left. Can't give up. Oh, okay. Hang on. I've got. You know what? I'm switching over to that, and I've got an 85 percent chance. Watch me miss. Yeah. Oh, nice. <laughs> but I'm on fire now too. Apparently. It'll go away. Yeah, eventually. So this legionnaire had a uh, a halberd. Six, that's actually not too bad. Six to fifteen damage, and then also had devil foil mask. The Americans' leader might still be around here. Oh, was that foreshadowing? Seems simple enough. Yeah, we should be. Uh, short rest, if you don't mind. Hang on, just gotta light some candles first. Gotta set the mood for the rest. Uh, okay. than nothing. I did that just in case the blood to the candles <laughs> caused us to get oh, into more on. trouble. We had to get in the mood. <laughs> so there is another devil foil mask there, as you say. Yeah, pick it up. Okay, I'll pick it up. I got XP. Very cool. There's a chest here. It's got a fire stoker. It is a hand crossbow. I think we know somebody who uh, uses those. Does yeah, four, I like four to 12 damage. I'm not proficient with them uh, at all. Um, there's gold, uh, malachite, and a scroll of confusion. Uh, I'm going to send that to Zar. You're overburdened. Cool. Eh, am I? I'm very close. Interesting. That's okay. Not a problem. Can get rid of some stuff. Sending things to camp is amazing. <laughs> I think that's pretty cool, yeah. Oh, I missed some candles. So there's a big shiny object at the back of this room, but I can't do anything with it. All right, well, um, do you see anything inter interesting? There is an empty jelly ochre. Really? I don't remember the jelly ochre being in part of this little mission. I, th I think it was empty. There's. Uh, it looks like one of the Hell's Boars hasn't been looted. Oh. Uh... Oh. Something good here, I hope. Which one? Uh, there, there's like a little pile of two of them. Oh, yeah, hold, hold down Alt, and they'll give you one with the star next to it. Yeah, they look the same. Oh, okay. They're they um okay. They're they're okay. all empty. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, you opened it. I guess it didn't have it. my feet can carry me. Yep. Um. What have we done? Where are we going? What are we? What is the situation? I am not. A, Absolutely sure. Uh, I'm gonna try this halberd out. I think you're gonna do what? Oh, you got a new I'm weapon? Try this halb. Yeah, from that mirror again. It does the same amount of damage, but it has an extra reach. It's also it's quite, about as big as I am. It, it's quite huge. All right. Well, I wish you luck in your halberdy halb halberding. I know, I thought that might be something as well. I went over there. I also lit all the candles, because, you know, oh, except for these ones. Yeah. All right. And, mm -hmm. Oh, there's a rusted key over here. What? Where? I know. It was on the floor. I, I happened to hold down Alt in the right spot. Oh, there's an old letter. I'm going to send you the old letter. How come I'm not seeing these things? I'm, I've been holding Alt um, down. Yeah, no, I, I think I had to be in the right, like, position, 
and I moused over one by accident, to be okay. honest. This old leather, which I just I just gave it to you. Okay. Uh, Sybil, my scouts bring me troubling word that Moonhaven yet stands. Have you forgotten the three laws? Would you turn your back on Mistress Shar? Tonight you will be you will beg Shar's forgiveness. Tomorrow I depart Moonrise Towers for Grimforge. A ten day hence I shall march the dark Justicars to Moonhaven myself. By the time the first star trembles that night, the Selenites shall be slain and their allies routed. Speak your prayer thrice nightly, Sybil, once at nightfall, once at moon zenith, and once before sunrise. I shall remind you the words, lest you've forgotten. Mistress Shar, I have, for I have glorified your name. Master Thorm, I have cried out your word. I am your servant forevermore. Demonstrate your devotion, and Shar may still know you. Fail, and you are not but dust and un unknown and unremembered. Tethric Thorm. Okay. Wow. Mm hmm. I mean, this place right. has the smell of evil about it. Like it definitely that has does. that that kind of evilly feel. But I think we're done. All right. Yep. I think so. It's on the map. Now we've been over the other side there, right? Uh, northwest. But we've, we've uncovered all of that. It's not in the fog of war. So I think we've been there. Yep. Yeah, that. So, um, yeah, the northwest and northeast of us, we've been in both places. <laughs> so where we need to go next is there is a ledge. Oh. Travel through the Underdark. There is a portal over here. Do you see that? Oh, where at? I'm sorry. I'm looking at your screen now. Right here. Yeah, okay, so that will that's an elevator that will take us towards Act 2. Okay. Uh, we still have... I'm just going to go out the... We um, uh -huh. Oh, I was saying, we still have quite a bit of um, stuff to do in Act 1 if we want to go and do, like... Uh, Lazelle's, like, mission and whatnot. Oh, I, I'm not saying we go should go. I'm just curious about what's uh, what I'm seeing here. Hang on a sec. Uh, straight across. Yeah, for some elevator. reason. For some reason, I feel like... What? I feel like we're missing something in this room. So this is an elevator right here? It... I don't know. It could be. We can go check it out. No, we were already here. I've pulled both these levers. Oh, no, that's that's just where we came down. I don't think that's an elevator. Sorry, I, I didn't recognize it. on the map, it. that's where the elevator is. Um, no, underneath... So we go underneath it? That, that right there? It's... Yeah, there's a there's so you remember where the how we went up the up the staircase? Yeah, yeah. To, and, and when we and first watched, landed on the ship. Well, no, when we when we went up the staircase and and watched those the the two uh, Duragar get poisoned. That's the entrance to the oh. to the elevator. Okay, well, <clears throat> where are you? Where did you get to? You're up oh, there. I'm, yeah, I thought I, I swore that there was something more to that room. I can't, I can't figure it out. Okay. If we go south from here. Mm -hmm. Whoa. Okay. This way. And then we jump across here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember seeing this earlier. Right, right, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a skeleton up here. There's loots. Oh, 
always room for more. Um. All of my, uh, it's funny, all of the, what do you call it, disappeared, all of the scenery disappeared. I, I was just floating in midair because some weird camera thing. Map of Moonhaven. This war map offers detail, a, a detailed plan to attack the village of Moonhaven, encouraging soldiers to kill in merciless silence. All right, I'll, I'll grab that. Thank you for the map of Moonhaven. <laughs> what is this? A mirror? I'm using the mirror, but it doesn't seem to be doing anything. Uh, scroll, uh, maybe scroll down on your on your uh, log window. Oh. Does it say anything at the bottom there? Nope. There's a plaque down here. In the beginning came morning, then night. Two sisters clashed, one dark and one light. Selune and Char? Exactly. The constant struggle between the two. Yeah, they, uh... They fight quite a bit. All right. Well, I'm going up. There's two, uh, there's two levers up here. Okay. That's not so to do. Oh, a scimitar mold. Uh, scroll of feather fall and a short sword. You can I'm send the mold over to, uh, Zar if you want. Okay. There is a splint, like a splint mail mold over here that we can see we can't get to. Yep, I see it. Okay, shall we throw one of the levers? Oh, yeah, go for it. Let's see what happens. Ah! Okay, so this is a way to get... Wow, how do we even get back over there? Uh, you're headed over there, I'm taking it. There you are. Yeah, I was just trying, seeing if I could jump across that little area, and it did work. Oh, I'm going to give you a potion of invisibility. I found it on this guy. Let's check this see what's down here to bypass this whole... Um, Walkway here, but no, we didn't, we didn't miss anything. Uh, your uh, your ride is waiting for you, but I don't know how we would all get on that. Considering the control, oh, I guess we could shoot the controls from over there. The platform's covered in rust. Must be all the bone dust. All right. Um, see if you can send me over. Do I want you to be, do you want to be up? Um, I think I can jump here. Is there anything up? Up there? Or... I don't know. Well, this looks interesting. Yeah, I'm trying to see if there's... Can I jump down here? Oh, I can jump down here because I've got the strength to do so. I wasn't sure. I'm going to go stealth. Oh, you found a sigil. Yeah, did I unlock it? Yep. 
cool. Yeah, we can all just, just yeah, do that. Yeah, but uh, in the meantime, uh, we want to get that. Uh, you can get it from over there. All right. What's it called? The uh, uh, I don't remember. Ancient. It's called Ancient Sigil. Ancient Forge. Like it. Looks like that's it. Uh huh. I'm here. Is this the uh, is this the forge that we're looking for? I think we're getting there. Uh, dusty book, onyx. Uh oh, dark Justicar helm, swathed in shadow. So it, uh, while obscured in shadow, the wearer gains plus one to saving throws when attacked. I mean, I'll grab it. Uh, I, let me take a look at this book. Uh, praise be to the Lady of Loss. She has, she has through her sister Ansar, taught Brother Suluv uh, the na true nature of our lives. But they, but they are a loss and nothing but loss. Through the sorrowful lesson, he has turned from his fame and following to come to us into the Lady's loving embrace. But he has not left everything behind. The man once known as Sulav Yali, uh, Siluv Yali, uh, brings with him the miracle of metallurgy. This dark alloy adamantine will let us spread the Dark Lady's will with new fervor. Well, all right. <laughs> there is a Hooray forge for plaque. There, th that looks like a forge down there. Does that not look like a forge? Looks, yeah, looks, looks pretty close. I'm going to send you a scribbled note that I found on this guy. I'm going to read the forge plaque. Centuries of blazing heat have smoothed away the plaque's inscription. Oh. You can't, it, you can't read it, apparently. But it says forge plaque. You sent me what? A scribbled note. Uh, must find new sources. Nearby mithril veins are near depletion, and the quantities that required for Brother Siluv's Silu, most recent project were considerable. Some of the acolytes have taken to calling it grim for the place it was made, though never within Brother Sulu's hearing. So this is the grim forge. Correct. Ah! Aha! Uh, there's a lot of, like, bits and pieces and stuff around here. There is a lot of stuff around. Look at all the, like, ar bits of armor, but none of it can be used. No, I, I don't know if bodies used to be in that armor or not. Uh oh You got yourself fit. Uh, anima animated yeah, armor. Animated armor. Cool. I will head over there very shortly. I, I've, I found a uh, scale mail mold. I was going to pick it up, and bad things happened. It's all good. Um, I sent Angela a, um, a thing. A, uh, what do you call it? A scroll of something important. I can't remember now. I just read it, and it immediately left my mind. Uh... I, I think uh, it's... here touch. Sorry. Okay, I probably already have a scroll of that somewhere because uh, scroll of vampiric touch. I have three of them now. Okay. I'm also <laughs> sending you a forge construction log. I uh, we're in the middle of a fight. I uh, don't know if you've <laughs> noticed this, but what bad things yeah, are happening? I've got. To, Where did you go? I've got to make. I gotta make it back over to you. I was just exploring this area over here and seeing if there was a heavy chest that had uh, <laughs> a mold and some other stuff in it. Okay, there's animated armor. Yeah, I can definitely help with the animated armor here shortly. I mean, I don't mind. Oh, there's lots of these skeletons. Oh, there's another. There's There's three of them. No, four of them at least. What you doing? 
I'm running over towards you. Oh, I'm hey. To be being very difficult. Hi. Oh, You're, you are like in the way, fight. Yeah, I was way out of their thing, too. That's terrible. Like their, their vision. But it is what it is. Okay. Um, you know what I can do? Uh, can I do another fireball? Oh, I think I can. Do you think that they're... Oh, you know what? No. No. Uh, this music? It's the chanting music? It's quite if intense, listen, isn't it? It is, but if you listen to it, they will say, live in La Vida Loca ah. at one point. <laughs> so they are anti-magic susceptible. And they have an extra attack. They have an opportunity attack, but they are resistant to poison and psychic. They are not resistant to fire. Do you know what that means? Go for it. That means... Uh... Oh, not enough movement. Oh, okay. Hang on a sec. Hang on a sec. Bombs away. Oh, path is interrupted. There we go. Bombs away. <laughs> they've got that a. Is, they got some nice damage. They got a couple of hit points left. They have a few. Just to, just some. The, the, the only bad thing. Yeah. <laughs> is that it blew up the ladder to get to them. Oh. <laughs> That's a bit of a problem, isn't it? Yeah, it can be, but that's all right. We will figure it out. <laughs> all right. Uh, I'm going to run over here. There's a guy around the corner that... I saw him. He's right there. Try and take him He's out. He's hiding. Yeah. I can't... Oh, but I can switch over and I can shoot him. All right. And then that'll be my turn. If I can, I can't see. I don't think I can get a. I don't think I can get a drop on them at all. I can't hit anybody, so. So he's staring to wait. All right. I think they're going after you. <laughs> but they missed. Oh, not the second time. Oh, maybe. oh they missed. <laughs> Miss. <laughs> All right. Uh, I think I would think that they would be particularly. Oh, high defense. Oh, bend luck. Oh, I, get a shot. Eat some of your I did it. <laughs> nice. Yeah, the, the bend lock thing, or bend luck thing, um, it only takes a couple of your sorcery points, and you haven't been using them a ton lately, anyways. Yeah, I think that that I think that works really well. All right. What you gonna do? Oh, I should have. Oh, I've got my shield up. Critical hit. Really? Oh my goodness. That's okay, we pulled him to us. That's that is super helpful. Fireball! <laughs> Animated armor down. Another step forward. Is there another I could play music, I can I can perform, I can play a tune. I'm just trying to see if I can get a get an angle on any of these guys. Nope. Oh, I can't hear, and I'm hiding, so I can use my my critical or my sneak attack. Got him. He's down. There's yes. just the one guy up he on went, the catwalk. He went down hard. Okay, that was actually pretty cool. All right, can I get up there? Oh, yeah. 
There you go. Smashy, smashy. <laughs> I have a turn. Uh, if I come over here, here can I, let's see if I can. Um, oh, you know what? I'm gonna come over this way. Oh, missed. Okay, never mind. Oh, I can misty step. I can come up and join you, but I don't know if there's any use in that. He's got 10 hit points left. I should be able to hit to, to hit him once or twice. I would hope so. Anyway, I'm just going to try to hit him right now. All right. Then that does it that right there. Okay. Got a mold. Uh, I'm sending that to, uh, I'm going to send that to you. Okay. Oh, let's see. What have we got? Got a guy right here. Uh, he has a great sword, but it's not, like, special. And, uh, okay, there's that, too. <sighs> He's got a candle. How do people do this all day? <laughs> there you are. Oh, I think this is just regular weaponry. It's not What's special. Hiding here? Oh, this guy's got gold. But he was he's not one of the wet warriors. He's just a dead guy. Oh! A, another dark justic Oh, a dark justicer mask. That's not the same. Yeah, some of them are not the same. It does intimidation plus one. Uh, is, isn't, uh, you know what? Uh, worn by Shar's most loyal zealots. Shadowheart. My faith will guide me. Shadowheart. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> There she goes. I saw something on the screen that said ready to burst. Never a dull moment. Ready to what? Ready to find a way forward. Burst. Don't know what it was in relation to, but I saw it pop up uh, on the screen. I don't know. There's adamantine over here. Mithril vein, I mean. How, how uh, do you think we can make these... Uh, Zark, Zark can make some pretty good jumps. Oh, okay. So here, There's no jump needed. Here, yeah, so here's something that I want to warn you about. What? Your companions will walk into the lava and die because they just do that. So you might want to ungroup. Uh, okay. Faith protects me. I must keep going. She says her faith protects her. Um, survive. Yeah, fit doesn't. Ready to burst. What's ready to burst? Survival failed too. Uh. Still you need to slash it. Despite everything. Angela's what what is that? Oh, it's immune to slashing. I was trying to To hit the missile vein. So this mithril ore that flew out. Do you want me to grab it or do you want to go grab it? Go for it. I can't carry anymore. That's all. There was just the one piece. I think. Yeah, I'm gonna try to bring. I'm gonna try to bring a staring over to see if he can make that survival okay. check. Okay, I'm just gonna look over here. I don't think I can go any further. 
No. Yeah, I can't do any more. If not over, then through. It, it might be better to use the, uh... You know, we all failed the survival check. Great. What is it? I think you're right. It's probably better to, instead of trying to run back that way, just to use the ancient forge uh, warp point. <clears throat> yep. Yeah. I think we've looted. Yeah, I think we've looted our way. Okay, you know what, map? Oh, I, I ungrouped. Right. I'll go this way. Is that blood? All right. No, oh, mind. you're back too. Okay. Hi. Welcome. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. Well, that was exciting. Um, there is a bunch of stuff around this forge. Yeah. F1. F1. Okay. Like up here, for example. Moving ahead. There's a sign. Forge Overlook. Forge your blade in the fires and raise it in the mistress's name. So the Grim Forge is a, sh if, uh, is a Shar Forge? Yeah. yeah, this whole thing is is Shars. Not a Star <laughs> Forge. A Shar <laughs> Forge. Get it? Shar Forge. Star Very forge. correct. <laughs> <laughs> How did uh, how did Shadowheart not know about it? I think that this probably fell like into disrepair, or uh, if, basically what ended up happening is the something. I think like the legions of hell or What's something inside? came through here and busted in here and killed everybody. Right? They actually did some pretty hefty damage. So it kind of got lost in history. I see. So I don't think Shadowheart knew anything about it. Wow. What what good is she then? <laughs> <laughs> well, and, and I'm kidding. Sure erases. No, no, well, Shar also erases memories, right? And yeah. only lets people remember what she wants them to remember, specifically to like do their their and everything in their missions. There's stacks of books here, but none of them have anything in them. Yeah, they, those were all empty. I, the, I looted some stuff up there. Oh, you've been here I, already. Those, oh. Yeah, all that's, right. that's why I gave you, like, the notes. Well, I want you to still be able to see it because there's actually some pretty cool views and stuff up there and like the plaques and whatnot. It is kind of neat. There is a path on the right. Did you see this? Oh, we've been down here. That's how we got the uh, mithril. So, so here's, I got, I got, let me, uh, let me see if I can put um, two and two together. Okay. We have a bunch of uh, forge, for, like forms, some, uh, you know, Casts, right? We have Mithril and we have a forge. I am I am I putting two and two together correctly? Yep. But I guess we get to choose what it is that we make because we only have enough Mithril to make one thing. Right now we only have one piece of Mithril, yes. Ah, there might be more. Oh, I see more mithril. Yeah, we got to go down and and do some uh, some investigation and stuff. Um, you know, we're, <laughs> are we? Uh, I'm gonna are, go ahead. Is that something we do next time? Yeah, it might not be a bad place to stop for tonight. I'm gonna hit the. I'm gonna hit a, 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 a short rest real quick um, because we were getting we were pretty damaged. Oh, and you and your short rests. <laughs> nah, you yeah, didn't, you just yeah. want your health back. Oh, I feel sick. Oh, my guts are hanging out. 
Yeah, I like to keep the guts. You need, you need, yeah, I know you need your short rest so that you can stitch those guts back up again. I get it. I get it. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, pretty much at this point, my insides are being held up with like duct tape and bailing wire. I think that's pretty well true for all of us. I mean, uh, <laughs> I, if you remember correctly, Angela was resurrected from 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 lava, so <laughs> she's feeling it. She's, she's yeah. Go ahead. She's not. She's not feeling confident around the lava situation. I, I was going to say she's probably having some PTSD moments for right me. I think so. I think so. So basically, we want to go down there, right? Into that, down that, that, that. that. This place looks yep, scary. And there's, well, there's some other areas to uh, explore, and there's like a, a lava elemental down there I saw roaming around. So, yeah, we got some. You saw. A, some you just saw a lava elemental just hanging out. Is that what you're saying? Yeah. It was walking through lava, but yeah, pretty much. This place is. This place is a nightmare. Yeah, if, if you don't love lava, this is not the place for you. <laughs> <laughs> or if you're like a yeti. <laughs> Yeti's Yeti's not not comfortable here. The yeti Yeti would would definitely suffer. All right, yeah, I think you're right. This is a good place to stop. So, uh, yeah. All right. Well, thanks, Dread. Thank you. I, yeah, this was, was this is good. Yeah, it's a lot of fun, and we we have. We have a, some more stuff to do down here, and then I figure that once we get that done, uh, we can kind of we could take that that uh, elevator. Yep. Back at the beginning, up to like towards the uh, the Shadowlands, which is Act Two. Ah, I thought we, we don't wanted have to, to go all the way in. It. I thought well, we yeah, we want... don't have to go all the way in. Uh huh. We just we just can go up the elevator and see what's up there, and then we we should probably go back and do. The, the Lizelle the stuff. Yep. Yeah. That the valley is Lizelle, right? Correct. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. That makes sense. All right. Well, thank you very much, everyone. Until next time, you all have yourselves a great day. Bye bye. Say bye, Dread. Have a good one. <laughs> good night, all. <laughs>